Hey guys, how's it going? John here. In this video, I want to cover three fantastic new features inside of Thrivecart Learn to make your student learning experience more personal, more customized, and more on brand for you. Let's get into it. So my wife and I, we've used Thrivecart for years. And when the new Learn platform popped up, which is their free online learning management system for online courses, memberships, things like that, when that popped up, we were super excited and we dove all in to help simplify our online learning platform as well as uh, simplifying all of our students' lives. And we highly recommend it for pretty much anybody who wants to launch a few products and make some money online without all the tech must and fuss. If you don't have Thrivecart yet and you're interested, there's some links down below that has a ton of bonuses and our personal support to help you get onboarded and started if you use our affiliate link. But the Learn platform has been kind of new. It's been fledgling for a while. It's missed some things that they've finally started to fix, and it makes us so happy. So in this video, I want to show you how we can turn this very simple um, start screen or dashboard screen into something that's a bit more on brand and customizable. We're also going to show you how to take your login screen from being a very generic login screen into a fully branded uh, welcomes your students the proper way. And lastly, I'll show you how to even set up your own custom domain for your courses. Whether you have one course, a thousand courses, it doesn't matter. You can have a custom domain like mycourse.mybrandname.com when they go to log in. In this example, we're going to set up a simple login.mybrand.com so you can send them through kind of a global process and make things super simple. All right, let's go ahead and dive in here. So this is what we have to start out with. We're going to start from the simplest and then go to the more complex of the updates here. So the, the basic online uh, dashboard here, it shows a very simple your name as well as your courses. And every course that they have access to is here inside this dashboard. Yes, I know we have a lot of courses. So what we're going to do is going to turn it from being very kind of blah into something a bit more on brand. Let's go ahead and do it together to access this new feature. Once you're inside the learn platform of Thrivecart up here, you'll be able to see this new button that says edit your students dashboard. So I'll click on that button right there. It's going to give you a little notification that just says this is where your students are going to go when they first sign in. I'll say don't show me this again. All right. So the first thing I want to do, I've never been a huge fan of this uh, navigation bar being this kind of dark gray. So what I'm going to do is grab one of our brand colors from our freedombynumber.com website. Go check it out. Some awesome stuff over there. I'll just grab this blue and we're going to come over here. I'm just using a simple free color picker Chrome extension and I'll come down to the nav bar and just paste this in right there. And already it's a little bit more on brand. Beautiful. All right. It also has a spot right here for us to add a logo. So let's go do that. Um, I'm going to come up here and just copy the, or let's save that image as our logo here. And I'll save it to our downloads folder and let's put it in here. So upload our logo and come on down to where I can add an image, go to our downloads, and it's going to be right here underneath image. Okay. Select it, use image. That's a little bit big, isn't it? So we're going to go ahead and make that a little smaller. Can Okay, that's looking a little bit too big. <laughs> so uh, we'll fix that in a, in a minute, but let's just leave it for now. Uh, I'll need to make it a bit more rectangular, I believe. Uh, that would be one thing I would say we should be able to fix is we should have a bit more granular control over the size, but hey, it's better than what it was before. And then we can have a little welcome message here. So it just says your courses. So we'll say welcome back, access all your content below. Okay. And now we have a bit more of a personal. You can do whatever you want to. You can add uh, frequently asked questions at the bottom. That might make a good. Uh, that would make some good sense here. You can you know bring an FAQ section down here. You can add a welcome video. A lot of different things you can do in this section here to make it a bit more you in the experience for your users. But for right now, we'll go ahead and hit save, and let's just preview one of our courses here. And if we go back into the dashboard, you can see here that it's all been updated. If I click through, it's going into the course and back here. Again, I will be fixing this probably after the recording of this video uh, to make that look a little bit nicer. <laughs> all right, I got a little impatient, so I went right into our little graphics editor and I just made a logo that would have an, a better resolution here so we can see we've got our Freedom by Number brand right there in our dashboard. Great. All right, so that's the first update. Customizing our student dashboard looks great, easy to use, big win for Thrivecart. All right, so the next one is a another 
big help for Thrivecart because the login page up until this point has been very ho-hum. Like it's been very generic looking, has not really screamed on brand or screen professional, and that is now fixed. So when you go into every course, this is something that's rather interesting. Interesting call by Thrivecart here. The, you can customize every single course's login page individually, meaning, you know, this freedom by number ebook is one of our uh, front end products. And that one can have its own login page, which is different from something else kind of makes sense. It's good flexibility. Um, but I would also like there to be a default login for everything. So kind of, um, I'm still working through that, but I think we're going to be okay here anyways. So when you go in to edit the course, you can come over here to course options. And then you've got a few new options here. You can customize the courses registration page. This is the page that you see when you first make your purchase. Let's say you're a brand new customer and you buy the product. As soon as you're done with your purchase process, you can create your account and log in to access your content. So this can all be customized now. Well, let's go ahead and do a very simple customization here. Again, I'm gonna take that color from our, um, from our branded colors and we'll come into this section here. And we're going to change that color to our brand color. We'll also go ahead and take our um, logo and plug the logo in here as well. Use that image. And already this is looking better. You can obviously add a bit more customization along the way. So these buttons, for example, I can change the button color to the right colors here and you can have some fun with it. So already this looks a little bit more like our brand. Our customers will be a bit more at home when they finish their purchase process. So that's a great one. This is customizing the registration page inside of Thrivecart Learn. Couldn't be easier and that'll work for us. Now let's also go in to customize the login page. Okay, this is gonna be used way more frequently than the registration page because you only need to register once, right? But you'll log in every single time you wanna join the platform. So let's go ahead and click over here. We can go right to the uh, customization area. Again, you kind of got the idea. It's all the same interface, very easy to do. I'll come over here, add my logo in as well. Kind of keep things simple. Not gonna go too crazy with customization yet. I might play with it after the video. Uh, and then let's also change the color of that button by clicking on the button. You can even change the text inside. You could say, let's, oops. You could say, let's learn. Whatever you wanna do, right? You've got some control. I'll keep it with sign in. I don't wanna get too cute with it. And there you go. You can even change the color of the forgot your password color if you'd like. I won't worry too much about that. All right. So now we've got that. So we'll check out how this all looks at the end, but I want to do one thing that will be absolutely a game changer for you. And to be fair, this feature has been there for a while, but I haven't covered it. I'll show you how right now to, instead of having some really awkward login a URL to go to, to have a very simple, we're going to create login.yourbrandname.com. And that will have your people come into one login screen, which you've customized, and they can log in and access their content. All right, we're going to do that with a custom domain for this course. And so all we need to do, once you're in the course options of one of your courses, we'll say enable a custom domain for this course, and we'll set up a custom domain. And what we're going to do now is simply create login.freedombynumber.com. And you can obviously, whatever domain you have access to. So if you want to use GoDaddy or Namecheap or Google domains in our example here, uh, you can create a custom domain for every individual course, which is a little bit overkill, honestly, but um, it's nice that you have that option. All right, so we're gonna do login.freedombynumber.com and here we go. So what we're gonna do here, let's see, let's go to generic and we're gonna create a CNAME record that's going to go right here. If this seems crazy to you, don't worry. We're going to do it step by step here. I'm going to click on copy the C name. We're going to go over to our domain registrar and manage custom records here. All right. So I'm going to come on down, add a new record. We are going to create a C name record called login. And then we're going to come back over to our instructions. Not there, not there, over here. And the value is going to be alias dot thrivecart.com paste that guy in there and hit save that should be it it may take a second to activate and do all that stuff but i'm going to go ahead and see if i get lucky by saying save custom record and we'll verify it and look at that 
we should already be good to go. So what I'll do now is save this. Oh, okay. I think they've also added this. I think this is also new. So inside of every course now, you have the ability to add in your support information, your support email address. So I'll go ahead and put in support at startamonblog.com. I know our brands are kind of all over the place. We're in a bit of a migration period here. All right, so we've saved that information. Now let's test to make sure that it works. I'll come into an incognito window and go to login.freedombynumber.com. And I'm gonna cross my fingers. And here we go. So it takes us directly to a nicely, newly branded login screen that has our logo, tells us we're here to sign in. And now, and also you can see up here, it's secure, login.freedombynumber.com. There's no .thrivecart.com anywhere. Nicely branded. I'll log in and say sign in, and that'll take me to now my nicely branded members area that has our welcome message, has my name. I can access my stuff here. And all of the courses are now accessible. Pretty cool, right? So that's it. That's one of the newest features in Thrivecart Learn. It's a total game changer because personally, we've been very pleased with the Learn platform, but the branding and like, it's always been kind of brand new. This finally makes it feel a bit more like it's ours. Our students will feel right at home. You can put your own custom fonts, colors, everything throughout the platform. It's a fantastic update. Thank you to Josh Bartlett and the team for keeping their platform updated and keeping up with the trends. And if you want to get started with Thrivecart, it's a one-time fee. It's fantastic. You buy once, you get all the updates as they go forward, including this online learning platform. So go ahead and click the link down below to check out the bonuses I'm offering as an affiliate of the product. I use it. I love it. I recommend it. So let's go ahead and make something great together. I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.